Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Uh, in this video, we're going to take a look at a new ransomware called Exotic. This was first discovered by security research researcher Malware Hunter team on October 12th. And um, this ransomware is uh, we believed to be currently in development. It's had three incarnations over the past three days. The first one, first two actually, showed a screen locker with the background of Hitler and some text. And this latest one um, no longer shows Hitler, but does include a jigsaw-like ransomware screen locker. So um, like any other ransomware, this particular one will target specific folders on a victim's computer, target specific file extensions that it will encrypt, and then it will encrypt them using AES-128 encryption. Um, once done encrypting a file, it will append the exotic extension on the file, uh, and it will also actually scramble um, the file name to a random name. So um, you'll see that see what happens in the video. Uh, these are the targeted extensions right here on the screen. And we have a folder of some test files that we're going to use um, for decryption through some on the desktop. And here's the main executable right here. So let's get going and start this. So as you can see, all the text files or the, the PNGs and the doc files were all scrambled to random names with an exotic extension. And then we have uh, the locker coming up. As you can see, it's very jigsaw-like. It has the screen text being typed on. We'll let this go through its thing and then we'll move on. Uh, one thing of note is the developer of this ransomware seems to be going by the name of Evil Twin. So a few things to note, um, it's $50 in Bitcoins to get the ransom key. It is a static Bitcoin address that's currently being used. We have a timer here of 72 hours. The ransom note states that every five hours files will be deleted. After 72 hours, all the rest of the files will be deleted and the computer will be shut down and the hard drive reformatted. Looking at the code though, uh, there's no deletion of files currently. Um, there is no formatting of the hard drive. What will happen though, at the end of 72 hours, the computer will be shut down. Um, as you can see, it still must be encrypting because none of these files were affected yet. Um, but all the files here were. One thing of, of interest is that there's a constant polling going on. Um, while this ransomware is active, it will be constantly polling certain folders, documents, desktop, uh, pictures, videos, but there was contacts and a few others. And if any new files are created, it will automatically encrypt them. So for example, we'll make a new file here called me, random text. And after a few seconds, minutes, whatever it is, it should be um, automatically transformed into an encrypted file of a random name. We're going to speed this up a little bit. All right, so the random text file has now been renamed. I'm a little surprised that nothing here in documents has been done yet. Uh, I'm sure if I wait long enough, it will be because it is, it is a targeted folder. But uh, we're going to end this video now. Um, uh, just one last thing. If we take a look, if we can get it open. You can't open Task Manager. I forgot about that. Um, basically, what happens is uh, this ransomware also terminate Task Manager, Process Explorer, Command Prompt, CCleaner for some reason, um, and a, quite a variety of other programs. It won't let you run them. It, if it detects that the process has been started, it will automatically execute it. Um, but one of the things I wanted to show you was that while this program is running, um, the CPU is going to be extremely high, almost pinned at 100% sometimes. So uh, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks.